Well, we go live to the Pan-African Parliament right now. No elections! No elections! No elections. No elections. The of committee, as the southern region, we are saying, if there is no rotation, no elections are going to take place yet. And therefore, the AU must come and intervene. Madam Chair, Madam Chair, Madam We're calling on Honorable Albino Matun Ayelo Boto to take the floor. Honorable Albino, you take the floor. Lutar na cam. Isto é behaving. Mande, mande chamar polícias. Mande chamar polícias para pôr ordem. Please call the police. Please call the police. Polícias para pôr ordem. É preciso. Order, order. We need some discipline here. We didn't come here to see a fight. Please call the police. Please call the police to put an order. Please call the police. Police, yes. Please call the police to put an order here. It is urgent. It is urgent. You should call the police. Please call the police. Please call the police. This is urgent. This is urgent. Please call the police. Please call the police. Please. Please call the police. Please call the police. Call the, police. Call the, police. the lose phone. Or 
asking to call the police. Please call the police. This is urgent to put an order here. Please call the police. Please, please call the police. Distinguished clerk, please call in the police. We need order in the house, please. The police should come in and put in some order. There is, they will need the police to come in. Distinguished clerk, the police has to come in. Can you please adjourn the house? No. Clerk of Mr. Clerk, Clerk you must adjourn can you please session. adjourn the house? No. Adjournment, no adjournment. And you must save no adjournment. Let's yet. continue with the no elections. Rotation, no elections in this park. Elections continuing. They are not going to continue. They continue with the no elections. No elections are going to continue unless you follow the proposal. And Shall and continue with this election today. <laughs> 
elections will go on. Elections must continue. Les élections vont se poursuivre. Elections will continue. There will be elections today. Please bring in the police to put some order in the house. Madam, please stop screaming. Elections will go ahead. If you don't want it, you get out. Simple. Election must continue. Let the election continue. Let the election continue. La police pour évacuer l'entrée. We need them. No rotation, no election. Let the election continue, please. Let the election continue. So Can you allow the election to continue? Let him or her get out. It's simple. Black agenda house, agenda house. We are proceeding. We are not going to adjoin. No, no, it's not about who Honorable members. Madame la Présidente, est-ce qu'on peut s'écouter est qu une seconde Madame Chair, Madame Chair, can, can we take the floor Madame la Présidente, est-ce qu'on peut s'écouter quelques minutes, s'il vous plaît This is not a plenary. This is an election. Nous avons trois candidats. Madame Chair, we have three candidates. We have three candidates who actually conducted, who were on the campaign campaign trail, and we brought them here for the election of the, the post of president, and we've come to the end of this exercise. So the elections must proceed; they must continue. This is people want to take our democracy hostage in Africa. Suspended by ECOWAS. It's already suspended by ECOWAS. The candidate should take the floor. Hey, you, and they make sure this house is. Can I have order, honorable members? What, how does it hurt you to, to just make sure we are rotating? Mr. How General, let's you? continue. Can I have order, honorable members? Agenda house. You are in Africa. So, how are they proof of our agenda house? We all want our rich. There is no rotation. We all want our regions to be in the chair. Sorry if you think it will always be in the West, in the East, whatsoever. We also want to be in the chair, Madam Chair, of the elections. That's all. No chaos, no violence, no what. But we want to see the, 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 the rotation principle followed in this house, or else no elections. Honorable members, distinguished members. Always. Oh, no. Honorable members. No, no. How is Mali? How is Mali having local standing members. in the house if they are suspended by ECOWAS? How is Mali having local standing? They are suspended by ECOWAS. Africa, Africa, all Africa. No, 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 no. no all Africa. All Africa, all Africa, all Africa. Election, election, election. Election. There is no document that will show you that. Election. So let's not sit here and for election. Election. That is rubbish. Election. 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 Okay. It's like that. We are suspended by ECOWAS. There is a coup d'état there. Honorable members, distinguished members, conformément à l'article. Honorable member. In line with um, Article 38, because we need order in the in in the chambers, 
We are simply asking those who are not members should please leave the chamber. And we're also asking the, our guest, whom I can see at the back of the hall, to please leave the gallery. No rotation, no election. Dinapala parole. Dinapala parole. Dinapala parole. I speak in Dinapala parole. No rotation. Honorable members, I've been asking. No rotation, no elections. Honorable members, we are asking no that all those who are not members of parliament to leave the plenary chamber. And we are asking our invited guests outside the chamber if they can leave also. That's we need order in the house. No Thank you. No rotation, no elections. No rotation, no elections. Hey, quitte là-bas, quitte là-bas, va rejoindre ta place, tu nous A point of order. Oh my god. Oh my, 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 my. No rotation, no election. Je ne sais pas combien d'argent on a dû te donner. Tu n'es pas le seul député ici. Tu ne peux rien empêcher. No rotation, no elections. No rotation, no election. No geographical rotation, no election. No, the, no rotation, no elections. No rotation, no elections. The AU should come here. No rotation, no election. Honorable, Honorable Barbara, can you please take your seat? No, take we your seat. We are asking all the invited no, guests no, in the gallery no, to leave no, the galleries. No, no, please. Can you please leave the seat? You are not. You have not been sworn in as a chair. You have not been sworn in. Who have not been a colleague of the Madam Barbara Swain, please. Your committee. You are not a member of the Adjoint Committee. Honourable Barbara, can you please take your seat? Please sworn in the report. You have not been sworn in to lead and to, to delegate and to manage this election. You are, you must have taken an oath. After taking an oath, that's when you're going to diminish an election. Otherwise, A, you must come here and administer the election. Without taking an oath to, to manage the election, you are not mandated to, to administer this election. This election cannot proceed without you taking an oath. Janet Kabira, you, are not, you don't have the mandate to take an oath. You have not taken an oath. Leave the place immediately. Yeah. and get away from that seat. You cannot administer an election without taking an oath. Yes. Nobody has sworn you in. You cannot do an administration for an election without taking an oath. Hey, you must come in and administer the elections. Period. No, no. First of all, he wait. He should stop. Okay. Honorable, uh, I'm not gonna, we're not gonna engage in a debate because we don't have the power. How elections are supposed to be uh, administered. We know that uh, the bone of contention is the issue of uh, the rotation. You know that uh, SADC region and some member countries of the Pan-African Parliament have indicated that uh, the issue of rotation is very important as it is a means to unite the African continent. But you have members of Pan-African Parliament, particularly from ECOWAS and the North, some of them, and the East who are saying that uh, they cannot endorse or support the legal opinion from the, pen, from the, from the AU that indicated that uh, member states
states should ensure that they adopt a principle of rotation. Now, those who are against the rotation are saying that that principle can only apply when all member states of the Pan-African Parliament have ratified the, uh, the, the proposal. But unfortunately, they are arguing that uh, as it stands, it is just an advice. Secondly, they are arguing that uh, they will only implement or endorse or put into practice the rotation uh, principle when heads of state at the AU level have given an instruction for that to happen. But for now, because it is the SADC region that requested a legal opinion from the AU, they will not uh, subscribe or implement the principle of rotation right now. So you can see now uh, the southern region and some member countries are calling for uh, perhaps uh, the elections not to take place. And you saw the commotion earlier on. Back to you in studio. Senhora que pode tirar na negócio. Qual é o novo da? Madame Chair, qual é o novo da? Polis, la polis. Qual é o novo da, Madame Chair? Honorable members, can you please take your seats? Can you take your seats? We're going to proceed with the vote. Point of order, Madam Chair. How can the undemocratic run the democracy? Democracy man vote. No, there is no We're gonna proceed with the election. We're gonna proceed. Let them proceed. This is not your home. It's a parliament. You have to listen from us. Okay. Point of order, Madam Chair. Point of order. Madam Chair, point of order. Well, well. Point of order, Madam Chair. How do you want the undemocratic? The undemocratic must point leave the democratic. Order. Why? Madam Chair, point of order. Point of order, please. Madam Chair, procedure. Take it, take it, take it, take it. Give me also, take it, give me. Wala. That guy is calling us on. Madam La President. Point of order, Madam Chair. Point of order. The thing has come now. Point of order. La sécurité, la sécurité pour sécuriser les urnes. Madame Chair. We need the security, the security officers to ensure that the ballots are safe. Madame la Présidente. Madame Chair, point of order. Madame la Présidente. Point of order. Madame la Présidente. Point of order. Madame Chair, we would ask that you condemn the in incitement to violence our responsibilities are individual here we have come to vote it seems the microphones are not working the parliament 
is the majority, and the majority wants us to proceed with elections. Would you ca kindly take your seats so that elections can proceed? Honorable. No rotation, no elections. I'm fine, how are you? No rotation, no elections. Who gave that no floor? No rotation, Who gave you the no floor? elections. Who Madame, gave that floor? Madame la Présidente. Who gave you? Madam President. Madam Chair, the ad hoc committee can continue to run the uh, administer the, the parliament until the African Union comes to ensure elections take place. We will have the ad hoc committee in charge. Why are you afraid of the votes? You're afraid because you will not win the election. Hey, Zimbabwe one, get down. Move away from that place, please. You are interrupting. Moi, je ne sais pas comment vous aimez ça tout le temps, tout le temps. J'aime pas beaucoup. Pas beaucoup. There is an AU position. It must be respected. Mali is having a coup d'état. There is no democracy there. You come from Kudita country, you want to teach me about democracy. No, no, no. The, the, the AU gave you a directive. AU gave you a directive. This is the AU directive. AU letter. The AU committee. This is AU committee. It is rotation time. Yeah, what is it to you? No, no, no. We're still in the this letter is sent to you, it's not, uh, this letter is sent to you, Honorable. You, you want to collapse this organization? She gives the order to the head of the how many people should give you an order? Seven. Address? Legal opinion is a legal opinion. The institution you respect is what? It's the order. Ah. Oh. I need a Fenega film again to Sama Sama Lanet. We will be filming. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Honorable members, can you please take your seats? Honorable, s'il vous plaît. Honorable members here, can you take your seats, please? What do we do with the...
président vous parle, suivez ce The chair is speaking to you and giving instructions. Please follow those instructions. All the MPs who are standing in the front, please kindly take your seats. Honorable members of parliament, kindly take your seats. I'm not pointing a finger. Ah, ah, Kasi is in the lake. This is the letter. This is the letter. Why is it belonging this letter? This is the letter. Madame la Présidente, s'il n'y a pas de... Madam Chair, if there is no election, the respective governments should take up their responsibilities. If there are no elections, we will no longer come here. And it will be your responsibility. In the annals of history, you will have to bear the responsibility for this. Barbara, don't touch me. Don't Some people like you are out here. Some people like you. No, no, no. Donne-moi ton cartable. Donne-moi ton cartable. Donne-moi ton cartable. No, just the cartab, just the cartab. Il va perdre la Il va perdre la cabeza. Il va perdre la cabeza. Where is the police? Albino, come, come, come. Where are the police? You have floor, come. Don't point at me, why are you pointing at the lady? Why are you pointing at the lady? Why? 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 How can you point at the lady? What you are doing is not good. You are. So why are you pointing at the lady? We are not going to do that. And speak. Get the human rights. What you are talking? Nobody talks to you. Let him to talk. That's the right. I am not a candidate. What will you feel me? So why are you here? No, I'm here. I need the peace. I need the peace. I need the peace. No, I need the peace. I need the peace. I need the peace. I need the peace. Me, I am here for the peace. If South Africa, si l'Afrique du Sud n'est pas n'est pas prêt pour if South Africa is not ready to continue to host the headquarters of the organization, we can move to another country. 
No, no, I cannot just suspend like this. Yeah, we are waiting for the. It's not. I have no powers to suspend the elections. Why? Why are you waiting to sit there? No, just leave it. What do you mean? No, 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 just leave it. No. We beg the president. On ne parle d'Union africaine là. Il peut, il bute là-bas. Il bute là-bas qui est là-bas. Je crois, je crois que les candidats. The candidates should. You come. If the election is disputed, you can't have an election. There's no credibility. You do disputing election. Hey, you must just come. Because the issue of rotation is very important. How can money that is suspended in Ecuador have a local standing to run the president? What? Yes, that is strong, eh? I've just told the chairperson that what is he, 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 he winning about? Because we are in Af Africa. Because we are in South Africa. If South Africa is not, don't want to continue to receive the parliament, another country will receive it. Yes. Okay. If Africa du Sud veut plus recevoir le parlement. South Africa is no longer willing to host the parliament. We will choose another headquarters because we are not safe here. Our security is at risk here. Point of order, Chairperson. The point of order is that uh, that lone voice there, an isolated voice that seeks to cast doubt on the ability of South Africa to host this parliament is indeed a Madame voice. La Présidente, y a des personnes armées dans la... Madame President, there are armed persons in the room. The clerk of parliament, there are armed people here in the room. I'd like to point out that there are armed persons here in the room. I'm calling upon the clerk of parliament to take note. Can you please ensure our security here? We do not feel we are safe. To ensure that we restore dignity to this chaos that seems to be reigning now. Si l'Afrique du Sud veut pas recevoir. If. This whole idea. South Africa Authority, we are not. Let's ensure that we do the work now, and if we can't, of course, uh, we can adjourn. And then the next meeting, under the guidance of, of the AU, continue with this work that, that needs to be done. There's, there's no one to do this work for us, other than ourselves. So this notion of uh, hoping that
We are not in security in South Africa. We will not We are not in security in South Africa. So we will not. We are not in security in South Africa. To speak We are not in security in South Africa. If the country don't want to continue to receive the parliament, we will take our disposition. We have. We are 55 countries. Being, we're being harassed by South Africans. And the entire continent of Africa is being held hostage by South Africa. Security in South Africa. There are armed people. Clerk, may I point out that there are armed persons in the room. And this is terrorism. I tell you. You and the police. Hey, you must come here. The of the gentleman, the people of African Union, don't do it us. Don't fight. Save. Don't fight. The people and police of the African that they let us come on. Our rules are on the roof. Hey, you. Hey, you. Do you have a rule? Hey, you. You. Do you have a rule? Hey, you. The people of the Do you have a rule? Hey, you. You yourself, chairman of rules. Are you? All the members of parliament from the entire continent of Africa are being threatened here and it seems there's no security for us we are not we feel we're in danger we are being threatened here by South African members of Parliament and we are not safe no one is coming to our aid <laughs> Madame la Présidente, sécurité. Madame Chair, there are armed persons circulating the room, and we are not feeling safe. No, 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 just, just be responsible. If this... No, 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 no. Madame, pouvons-nous savoir pourquoi? Madame, can you please tell us? Chair, please advise why is the police coming, not coming to secure the MPs here? Why are we not seeing any security coming to our aid? We are not in security in South Africa. Ils veulent pas de la sécurité, c'est ça le Nous changeons de siège. On demande de changer de siège. I'm going to request that we change the headquarters of the Pan African Parliament. We're not safe here.
We are just understanding everything now. It's not good. But they were cheering. It's not your line. Violence is not good. No, no, no. Everything is clear now. Everything is clear. It's our responsibility. No. This situation, no, please. but let's understand and go and Women. talk about it. No. Because what, what? you cannot want to permanently subject us to what you are subjecting us. No, no. Today. Yes, it means there's a hidden it's agenda. Opinion. Because how long? Opinion. How long this thing has not been taken place? You have a hidden agenda. You have a hidden agenda. You have a hidden agenda. You can use the opinion to go to the court. No, 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 please. No, you are, you are yes, I, I, I said, but you are, they are, they are you can't do all this trouble. No, 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 no. Let's call, let's again, uh -huh. call the AU uh -huh. to come and speak to this. On a besoin de la sécurité. Find each other. The only company. On est en danger en Afrique du Sud. To again this. Call the AU to come. Les députés sud-africains. A man kicks a woman. Sont en train de bloquer tout processus de vote. No, no, elec no, no rotation. No, 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 no election. No, c'est une erreur. Nous dénonçons No rotation, no elections. No rotation, no elections. No rotation, no elections. No rotation, no elections. Rotation, no, no, no rotation, no elections. No rotation, no elections. No Madame la Présidente, demandez aux députés de rejoindre leur place, Madame la Présidente. De rejoindre... No rotation, no elections. No rotation, no elections. No elections. No rotation, no elections. No rotation, no elections. No rotation, no elections. No election, no rotation. No rotation, no elections. Il n'y aura pas de rotation par la force. Il n'y aura pas de rotation par la force. L'Union africaine n'a donné aucun mandat à aucun député de venir parler à son nom ici au Parlement euh, euh, panafricain. Vous vous rendez responsable d'une violation du règlement no et des lois. No elections. No elections. No elections. And we are here, people defending Tagari. That's how you see it. That's how you see it. Take it. Kicking a woman. Please take a seat, sir. Please. Huh? Take your seat. You have no authority. Take your seat, please. You look very odd there, please. Go and sit down. And respect please. the chair. You, are, you look and very odd there. The honorable respect member, the chair. Go and sit down. Respect the chair. We cannot accept that. <laughs> All done. No rotation, All done. no elections. How can we have an election with violence? It we is can, what you look for it. We, you are the cause of the violence. Men kicking a woman. You no. are the cause of the violence. No. That's the, how can a man respect the chair? You don't want to respect the chair. Truth we have seen here a honorable, terrifying people's life. Everything. We have seen someone here who has terrified people's life. That's saying, I will kill you. And you never what complain about it. What a threat is that? It. Huh? A man 
woman killing a woman. La sécurité refuse de venir. No rotation, no election. La sécurité. La sécurité, la sécurité, la sécurité. It's okay. La sécurité. On est en danger. Are you ready for? I don't care. On est en danger. Okay. I don't care. We have to relocate and go to somewhere else. I don't care. No rotation, no election. A you should come. No elections, no rotation. No elections, no rotation. No rotation, no election. So can election go on? That's that. Please allow the election to go on. No rotation, no election. No elections, no rotation. No no election, no parliament. No election, you no rotation. You are green your heart, but no, you want to no, change no, what is in your heart. No election, you no parliament anymore. You are a disgrace to your parliament. We are not in security in South Africa. Oh yes. We are not in security in South Africa. We are not. We are not in security in South Africa. We are not. We want to be in security. Please. We need security. What do you mean of that? Thank you very much, South Africa, for with this reception. Thank you very much, South Africa. Si vous êtes fatigué, nous pouvons chercher un siège à l'Union africaine. No rotation. Si vous êtes fatigué, nous pouvons chercher un siège. Si l'Afrique du Sud est fatiguée. On peut chercher un siège. Il y a 55 États membres. Just because you want to dominate Pas Africa. un seul État. 55. We have 55 member countries, not just one. We don't know segregation. Because you want to dominate Africa, you kick a woman. No, 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 no. no. Your member no. threatened to kill an MP here. You never ah. speak about it. What type of an honorable what member? What kind of honorable member are you? Kicking you never a woman. to kill an MP here. You never talk because about you it. Because you are in right. the next, the next Friday, your friend said that you will kill somebody here. Africa the next, the next Friday, your friend said that you will kill somebody here. You never talk about it. The next Friday, the next Friday, your friend said your friend deputy. African Union. Men are talking to somebody. Will talk? Africa Union is in charge of all organs of Monsieur, vous êtes en train de Monsieur, vous êtes en train de prendre une très ministre, grande responsabilité. Can you please oh. votre place? So, could you please take your seat so that the chair can make a statement? And let's have order. Honorable members, can we resume our seats and have some order? The chairperson wants to make a statement. Okay. Honorable member, can you please take your seat? Thank you. Honorable members, I think we've discussed enough. You have discussed enough. There were people in front here members of this chamber my brother there now i think we have to take a decision and the decision has to be taken by the plenary one there are proposals to adjourn the sitting the second proposal is that we don't adjourn, we continue with our elections. If we, are, we do have to agree as a plenary, and what I'm suggesting is that we vote on that. Do we agree on that? Yeah, 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 yeah. We agree on that. 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 We ag
the whole parliament. Their so session issue has not the... been brought to us as a, an ad hoc committee. No, it's not been brought to us right. as an ad hoc committee. We are not going so to vote we cannot for anything. preside a debate uh, on that. Chairman. No, we are not going to accept not, that. Not at this point, Chairman. Not at this point, Chairman. I Democracy. In our, in our initial meeting, I asked yeah, you about we this. Have to talk, we have to talk on the Not at this point that you want yeah. to vote. Yeah. 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 No, no, no. No rotation, no voting, no election. Simple. No elections, no. No rotation. No, you do. No you votes. look at. No, 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 no elections, no rotation. No, 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 no. Ya pas ça. On te comprend pas. Quitte là-bas. Il faut quitter là-bas. On te comprend pas. Point of order. Point of order. Ya pas de point de order. On continue. Point of order. How do you proceed with the elections when one of the members are being kicked? Election. 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 Democracy. What? When you want to proceed with the election? You want to intimidate? No, no rotation, no election. No, no rotation, no election. Let's do Hello. S'il vous plaît, honorable, honorable distinguée ma. Please, honorable members. I said that the plenary is sovereign, and we've asked the plenary to decide. We can't take the decision on their behalf. Our vote. Let's vote. Please, we shall proceed with the vote. We've asked whether we want to have the elections, and those who don't want to have the elections will be at liberty to decide. And we can't vote for the second. We cannot the elections to be presided. Attend the house, there is a crisis. Recognize the crisis. Chairs. Against there is a crisis in this house. That is conducive for everybody. Not people just paying people money and every time use their countries. Nonsense. They are paying money, paying money, envelope. Honorable members, no. la plénière est souveraine. I have a proposal to put forth. We made a proposal to determine whether we hold the elections. Proposals. 
Honorable member, I don't want to be answering you directly because the issue of rotation wasn't brought to our approval Madam as Ka Madam a Kambila. ad hoc committee. Madam Kabila, you cannot say that. No, 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 finish my no, idea. No, I'm not going to allow you to finish. You have to allow me to finish. No. Madam Kabila, the yeah, well, it seems like uh, what's coming out of the Pan-African Parliament right now is no elections, no rotation, no rotation, no election. And that's the standoff currently that's happening in uh, Midrand. These are the live uh, visuals that are coming when the chaos erupted in Parliament uh, because members do not they want the elections to continue unless there is rotational leadership. And you remember that last week members of Parliament were engaged in fierce debate over the issue of rotation leadership instead of direct elections and they were saying that the current system is unlawful and therefore if you remember very well there was tension last week which led to where we are now where there was now a, a little bit of a scuffle there and uh, Pemima Jodina and of course uh, being kicked uh, by another member of parliament and of course shocking scenes come out of there coming out of there let's uh, speak to our foreign editor Sophie Mukwena. Uh, Sophie good afternoon uh, shocking scenes in parliament now take us through what has been happening I mean, it was expected. I don't think it's shocking at all because from last week it was clear from the SADC region and other member states that uh, the issue of uh, rotation was going to be a principle that they would want the Pan-African Parliament to adopt. And it is for that reason there was a decision to seek a legal opinion from the continental body, the AU. And indeed, the department that deals with legal matters pertaining to the Constitutive Act of the AU indicated that uh, there should be a rotation uh, principle applied by the Pan-African Parliament to ensure unity and inclusivity. But it looks like uh, the delegates from uh, the, the particularly ECOWAS and also some in the East Africa region have taken a decision to defy that legal advice from the AU, even questioning the person who signed that document that is actually indicating that uh, a rotation uh, principle, it is the principle that must be adopted by the Pan-African Parliament, like it's happening with the the AU, you know that uh, the AU chair, uh, to be elected AU chair as a country, it depends on which region has been able to lead the continental body. It doesn't uh, apply the issue of uh, enforcing or perhaps uh, uh, insisting that uh, people must just be elected. They use a rotation basis. That is why as we speak right now, the AU chair is DRC, the president of DRC. Some may ask, DRC is part of SADC but also part of EAC. It's because South Africa became the chair of the AU after Eswatini indicated that uh, they were not available and requested South Africa to step in. That is why President Ramaphosa was the AU chair last year. Now here it looks like members of uh, uh, Pan-African Parliament, they don't want to listen to that. Remember you have uh, people from opposition benches from different countries as well. And therefore clearly they may be using this platform to exercise their muscle or maybe to prove a point that they are here perhaps defying a word from the OA from the AU because the AU uh, at the assembly you have uh, heads of state and government or the principal uh, the, 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 the senior people there and maybe they are defying those uh, uh, leaders at the AU now you find a situation where there's an argument of no elections, no rotation, no rotations, no elections. So it is a, a standoff. It is really a standoff. We don't know what's likely to happen. So, Sophie, we heard them earlier saying that they are concerned about their safety as there are people walking around armed. Is that the case? 
I didn't see anyone with a gun. I don't want to lie and I can't deny or confirm. But this is what some members of Pan-African Parliament are saying. But I can guarantee you, uh, I think sometimes it is blown out of proportion in terms of uh, the issue of uh, guns and all of that. There might be in terms of uh, those who are providing security for maybe senior people in here because you know that there are people who are being provided with security and maybe it is the, the security but the security uh, I haven't seen anyone uh, behaving badly. The police are here but mostly at the gate it is indeed an attempt to respect the business of Pan-African Parliament. Uh, but you can see there is tension and uh, indeed uh, people are, are really pushing ahead. Uh, uh, I wonder if you were able to see the scaffold from a, a different view because it was a long shot from where I'm sitting but I saw a member of Parliament kicking a woman. Take us through that if you were able to see it closely. Yeah, it did happen. You had uh, some members of parliament arguing that you can't uh, do this to a woman. It's, it is one of members of parliament from the uh, East Africa region uh, who are forceful today. You can see from the SADC side or from the South African delegation, they are very restrained, much as they are part of the heated discussion there. But you can see now the lights is off. I don't know whether the intention is to stop the election. But like I said, uh, the South African delegation and also the uh, SADC delegation, uh, they are trying to exercise caution, particularly uh, after uh, Malema's video went viral. Of course, he indicated that it was taken out of context. He was responding to a member of parliament from Mali who had indicated that he's going to kill him. So, yeah, but with me here, I have a leader of the South African delegation here, uh, who is also the chair of the NCOP in South Africa, Ndate Masondo. Uh, Ndate Masondo, can you just explain to us this situation that's prevailing here doesn't uh, uh, show or present a good image of what this institution is all about? It's really a distortion of uh, reality. <coughs> uh, African Parliament has operated and worked well uh, over the years. Um, uh, and it's an institution that is broadly guided uh, by the work of the African Union. Um, and, and one of the principles of the African Union when it, when it comes to uh, electing leadership uh, is the principle of rotation. Uh, that no one region or a few regions uh, uh, will be allowed uh, to run uh, and, and have all the power uh, to run the work of the of, 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 of Pan-African Parliament uh, or have power uh, that, that, that cannot be mitigated uh, by the, uh, the, 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 the regions uh, that, are, that, are, that are in place. So it's, it's disappointing um, uh, that at this critical point in time uh, there are these differences uh, and the temperature has gone uh, a bit high. Uh, but we are confident uh, that we'll overcome uh, and that we look at this as one step in the develop development of the institution that we have had to, to go through. When I, my recollection uh, as a person who has covered the Pan-African Parliament is that uh, there has been problems with the previous president of the Pan-African uh, Parliament, Roger uh, Gondodong. And now, today again, he is marshalling and mobbing.
stabilizing. Build together and ensure that this institution is, becomes what it's supposed to be uh, and that indeed we should make a contribution. Uh, not finding one another, but the issue to note, uh, Mali in particular, this morning, ECOWAS has taken a decision or a result. Resolution to solve the delegates from Mali. Can they really be uh, having an authority to make contributions, even to vote? After suspended by ECOWAS this morning, Mali saying that uh, that will only apply to them, the delegates here, should African Union take a similar position or endorse the regional body. Uh, the position it has taken ECOWAS to suspend Mali, but uh, uh, we know that uh, the AU will not overrule a decision of the region because the AU always encourage a strengthening of the regional voice so that they can give guidance to the continental body. All right, uh, Sophie Mukwena coming to us live from a Pan-African Parliament. Uh, she's a life crossing away, and as soon as there are developments there, we will get in touch with her to get to know what happens uh, if this adjournment uh, will lead to the resumption of proceedings on whether or not there will be elections uh, today. So as you heard the undertone, there is uh, no election, no rotation, no rotation, no election. Uh, Dr. Charles Sinkala uh, of course, uh, he is the Africa and uh, International Affairs Analyst uh, to come and uh, uh, give us an analysis on what is happening. He is an expert with regard to uh, uh, Africa and international relations. Uh, good afternoon to you, sir. Uh, welcome to our program. Uh, you have been listening in. You have been observing the proceedings that have been disrupted uh, at the Pan-African Parliament. What do you make out of this uh, chaos? Well, yeah, it's, it's a totally nonsensical, you know, we do not expect to have such uh, um, global leaders, you know, to behave like uh, horribles. In fact, uh, most of them, they are their honorable members uh, elected by their respective constituencies from representing the countries which they are respecting uh, and representing. And if we look at the idea of a Pan-African Parliament, it's, a, it's an organ of the African Union uh, which gives a platform for members of Parliament uh, to converge in a year and discuss the regional and continental uh, problems. And I think uh, uh, the purpose has been diluted. But again, uh, we, we must also understand our history of differences between um, the Francophone countries, those who are on the west side of Africa and the east side of Africa, and as well the Anglophone from the southern and central Africa. We haven't had that very good relation in terms of uh, uh, working together as Africans. If you remember very well, uh, those who are colonized by the Portuguese, they feel that uh, they are more superior than those who are colonized by the Francophone, the French, and the Belgium, as well as the African Anglophone, and as well by the British. So that competition has always been there. Who's supposed to lead and who's supposed to be where? You know, which dilutes the main purpose of the Pan-African Parliament uh, to present its uh, core value and core purpose 
in terms of sorting out the regional and continental uh, problems. But again, you can see as well in the past week uh, how members of parliament, you know, rose up against each other. It also speaks to that uh, competition of uh, you call it in politics as tribalist uh, ethnic wars, you know, where they believe that uh, uh, only South Africa at this time maybe might be fit uh, in terms of being a leader of Pan-African parliament or as well they might feel that somebody from Mali now this time it's around, it's their chance to preside over that. You know, whatever the case that uh, they are trying to speak about in terms of uh, rotational leadership or elections, uh, whichever the case it might be, because it all goes to what is written in the constitution of uh, the Pan-African Parliament, uh, endorsed by the AU. Uh, it is that uh, leadership has to be rotational through that process. But that rotational leadership, there must be elections to elect another leader from a different uh, region. But again, what they forget to, uh, to talk about is that rotational leadership what does it qualify to be using the rotational, uh, rotational leadership? How can they appoint, uh, uh, for instance, uh, uh, President Felix Bekedi uh, as chairperson or president of the AU? You know, how can they appoint, uh, recently in the past, they appointed the RG Robert W. Mugabe to preside as president of uh, African Unity? How can they appoint? Uh, uh, leaders who have been in regions where there's coup d'etats like Mali and Chad, you know, that credibility of that person presiding as a leader of Pan-African Parliament brings a lot of questions. Appointments of leadership within the regional organization, within Pan-African organization, in fact, even AU, uh, must be based on meritocracy. They must choose the best of the best leaders who understands to preside over Pan-African Parliament. You know, you, know you, you mentioned something very, very profound when it comes to uh, leadership being rotational and uh, the meritorious, the inclination of making sure that you elect the right leaders. But then let me just ask this question concerning uh, leadership development. Do you think that these leaders go through training in terms of integrity, emotional intelligence, uh, diplomacy, and the way one should conduct oneself in a professional environment like this one, in terms of listening and knowing when to speak, uh, knowing to respect uh, another candidate or delegate's time to speak so that they can be able to debate issues because one can see that they're debating at intellectual level, but at the end of the day, uh, don't you think that this behavior is really appalling? Uh, Dr. Singala, I am not sure if we're still uh, having a link towards you, but the question that I was asking you was about uh, the leadership development of, uh, you know, honorable members of parliament of such stature in terms of uh, their training. Uh, do they get coaching in terms of uh, how they should be behave with integrity as they're debating issues at intellectual level, the integrity that one should have as an honorable member of parliament? Uh, yes, I think uh, one of the biggest crises that we have in Africa is leadership. You know, having leadership who's got uh, uh, emotional etiquette as well as the, uh, the IQ. You know, leaders who knows when to start talking and who knows when to listen uh, in terms of debating uh, very serious uh, issues uh, without the leaders who thinking how superior their culture is. Uh, or how uh, uh, recognition of their status, or how politically they are connected, or how they've got no fear in terms of dealing themselves. You know, unfortunately, uh, the training is only the induction uh, for you to pretend uh, to uh, to present yourself as a honourable member. Uh, there is no much training of the purpose of what you need to uh, to do as a leader, and in fact. Even in terms of debate, you can hear some of the members of parliament, what they debate is completely out of context, you know. Uh, the, the debate is more personalized than an inclusive uh, type of representation uh, from the countries which they are coming from. Uh, the leadership, yes, uh, you can see it has been questioned many times, the way they appoint them. If you are elected as a member of parliament from KwaZulu-Natal, the uh, country 
uh, from member states uh, that can appoint you as a representative from political parties. Normally, they appointed five uh, uh, members from each country. Uh, two can be from opposition political parties, and three can come from uh, ruling parties of that uh, individual countries. But the processes of these credentials for members of parliament is very questionable because the members of parliament are appointed the, to constituencies by branches, they call them, uh, without the, even basing on their education, on their qualification, on their, uh, you know, basis on how they can uh, represent that constituency, bring development, how they can defend uh, that constituency, how they can make change, you know, they are appointed based on popularity of a political party to, to win an election. Hence, you can see now that the effect of appointing such leadership, you've got this type of confusion in parliament where honorable members of parliament who are respected very highly with very high credentials representing their countries and they come and conduct themselves uh, like this, you know, even openly. Uh, uh, saying to other members that uh, I'll kill you, I'll kill you, uh, like what we had uh, from last week. I've never seen a leader who conduct himself like that. You know, look at the leadership uh, exercised by uh, President Sir Ramaphosa. He cannot be an angel, but you can see how content he is. And when he's speaking, his voice is content. That is the training and the education that has to come from a leader to have one purpose to perform and only one job and not to create confusion. Now the delay within this type of proceedings, but this time we are talking about uh, the problems uh, by leaders. You must remember, if leaders uh, fail to solve a problem, uh, leadership becomes a problem and the problem becomes leaders that we must concentrate. This time around, we are supposed to be watching the national television uh, that we love about uh, how are we gonna res uh, resolve the insurgencies uh, which are mushrooming next door to South Africa here in Mozambique, you know, how they threaten the peace and security within the region. How are we going to sort out now the problem in uh, Zimbabwe? How are we going to sort out now uh, the problems now recently in Ethiopia? Ethiopia, very not long ago, uh, we had the prime minister there being honored with a lucrative global award, you know, as the best leader. But now the situation there is bad. You know, recently, again, this week or last week, we had the coup d'etat from uh, Mali, where uh, the, the, the sitting president was uh, kidnapped. You know, these are the issues that we have to talk about. The migration, you know, the, 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 the child abuse, the women abuse, and as well as uh, human trafficking. But because of the leadership, they are not there to do one purpose, to manage the population which is growing. By 2023, it is estimated that... Uh, the population of Africa will be confirmed at very clean 1,7 billion people. But the question is, do we have the right calibers of leadership that can preside over this large population? Because you must remember, the more the population grows, the more we fail to manage the people on how to put them together. But you can see uh, from the footage and what uh, Sophie Mkwena, the, the correspondent, was saying, you know, it's total confusion within the parliament, uh, uh, Pan-African parliament that uh, we have hope, you know, hence, you know, uh, many African uh, countries now they are really looking at uh, uh, the viability of uh, these uh, organizations, bodies, uh, which uh, try to pretend to uh, uh, protect the interests of the public, because we do not say it, you know, now they are looking at the, uh, I see now these agitators of uh, those who want to create an independent body, uh, that will be completely a uh, non-state actors. You must remember all these people who are in the African Parliament, they are members of Parliament, they are state actors. So this is uh, what we, we need to look at, their leadership and the way we appoint the leaders. I thank you. All right. Uh, Tata Singala, I would like you to be on standby as we have to check in with uh, the proceedings in Parliament. So as we will be speaking to Sophie so that she can update us, is update us if uh, that adjournment uh, has been suspended or uh, the proceedings have resumed, we will get to know in a, a few minutes. But, but also what I wanted to ask you, uh, Dr. Sinkala, is uh, the issue of uh, the future of Africa being able to resolve its own problems and they are so fragmented at the moment. And you have been talking about uh, the issue of those who think that they are superior uh, than the other because of their, their stance of their colonial 
uh, masters. And uh, before you answer that question, let's just check in 